Good morning vlog, today is Monday, just to excuse the face, I haven't got any makeup on, my face is like broke out so I'm not putting any makeup on, so yeah, I do apologise about this monstrosity. I'm just going to go for an eye test because I think I'm blind, I have a really 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 tiny prescription which you know is pointless but I have glasses for it and then um, I'm going to get my eyes tested again just in case because I find myself especially at night like squinting like this to like see so yeah I'm gonna get my eyes tested and then I need to go to like B&M or something just get some little little bits and then my friend Becky is cooking tea so we are going there she's cooking stew and then I'm taking some pictures of her and Chloe and her dog they want like a nice little picture for the living room so I'm going to do that so I've left my camera on charge and that's about as exciting as my Monday gets so that's fantastic so hi guys just put in my shoes on now I've also just picked my cousin up from school but same again I didn't film because I just picked her up and then we have a cheeky little race up the hill and then I'll drop her off but just leaving my house now because I'm going to my friend Becky's. I'm going to try to stand you up. There. Going to my friend Becky's. Because like I said earlier, she wants a um, picture of Chloe, her daughter and the dog. So she can put it in the living room. But I still haven't received my battery for a giant um, camera light I bought. So I'm going to struggle to actually... Um, take pictures I literally I'm going to have to use my phone light and I've just remembered as I'm talking about it I have an LED which isn't great but we can give it a go um, yeah that's about it good morning it is around 10 o'clock on Tuesday morning and can anyone just like explain the weather like normally there's a massive view like over here and you can literally see nothing outside the back of my bedroom window as well you can't see a thing it's mental like it's just foggy everywhere i was laid in bed and i can honestly like hear the birds chirping and i was like oh yeah it actually feels like spring when you know when because i had my window open you know you can hear the birds chirping and yeah now i don't feel like it's spring so much anymore I excuse the way I look because I look like deaf and I've literally like stayed like this since I've woke up but I'm in the middle of painting my room I am painting this wall here I've just done my first coat so I'm gonna let that dry I also need to go over this wall here but I'm gonna tackle that in a bit I'm just gonna have a cup of tea and just to sit down um because it's like my room's so like claustrophobic so I've been like down there and yeah it's not great so I need a drink but yeah, this is pretty much what I'm doing today, Tuesday. I also have these really like long fairy lights, which I also put like into the back of my wardrobe. But then they're all here because they've all come down because they were like all around the roof. Um, and they've all come down and they're really long and I un honestly don't know what to do with them. Like I was thinking, this wall here, I could have them like up and down, up and down, but we'd have to see. I am also painting this wall. I don't know if you can see that colour there. This grey wall's going a lighter grey, so yeah, we'll see how that goes. But yeah, I'm just going to have a drink now and I'll catch you back in two seconds. Right guys, so I'm still at it. I think it's around three o'clock. I am um, painting still. There's a second... I can't even speak. I'm painting still. There's a second layer that's just gone on. But I've also... Hang on, I'll just show you. I've also realised that... I, I need another layer on there, don't judge me. That I had some shelves here and basically... There was a gap behind the shelves, so I pulled the shelves down, these shelves, and unclipped them. So not only am I painting my room, I've like just totally destroyed my room at the same time. Because now, these suitcases that are eyesores, because for some reason this house we rent, they decided to put wardrobes without doors on, I can put down here, but I need to put a second layer on. And there's like an aerial wire that goes out throughout the vent. But I don't have a TV in here and I've just decided to paint the wire purple, like my wall. So, yeah. It's like a shade, it actually looks purple, it's supposed to be like a shade of pink. 
Hmm. It actually looks a lot brighter in my room already though, so love that for me. I'm going to crack on with the window side um, just because of where it is and I want to get it done so I can move stuff. Like my bed's currently in the middle of the room, but there's hardly like a middle of this room because it's that small. Like look, everything's there and then that's the door and then pretty much there's a window. So yeah, it's very small. Um, but you got to make do with what you got, haven't you? So, yeah. Hi, oh, guys. I'm just letting my dog out in the garden for the toilet. But it's quite late, so I'm going to try and whisper. I painted my room, but then I sort of, like, dismantled part of my wardrobe as well. Because there's some reason in this house they've put, like, a wardrobe and then connected, like, extra shelves to it. But they've not actually, like, made use of any of the space. So the shelves weren't full length to the wall like the wardrobe were so I've pulled the shelves off they were screwed in separately so I have pulled them off Um so there's more room in the corner for me to like store stuff like my suitcase and just other boxes of stuff like because we've come from a five bedroomed house to like you can tell I've come inside now because I'm talking really loud we've come from a large house to a very small house and I've said this numerous of times like in my vlog and it's, it's just tricky to like store stuff so yeah basically um yeah i'm waiting for it to dry so then i can rearrange stuff and then i need to get the white paint the not white paint the lighter gray paint to do my other wall but um i'm starting to think maybe i should just leave not leave i'm starting to think maybe i should just do it all like the pink color but i want some sort of gray in there so um i don't know yet but we're letting the pink dry i've done all the layers that need to be like done so I need to get the, co I want copper trimmings, so I'm like getting copper mirrors. Um, they call it rose gold, but it's copper, you know, because um, I'm like fucking gok wan. Um, so yeah, it, it, I'm going to get so like a copper lamp, I'm going to get like a, not a lamp, a copper light shade thing, because the light shade in there at the moment is horrendous. Like whoever lived in this house before me, like... I'm sorry, like, there were two girls, like, around my age, so, like, you needed to sort yourselves out, like, the way you left this house was rank, so, yeah, <sighs> people just, like, the way, the way people live is weird, like, especially when you work on seasons, you know that people live the, uh, differently, and obviously that's what makes the world, but the way some people live is questionable isn't it so morning guys the day is wednesday i've just got ready just put my eyebrows on no makeup on because i'm only looking after my knees today i'm going over there her mum's just nipping out so i get to spend time with her so i'm so excited because i absolutely bloody love her to pieces and then i'm to oh i'm stuck i'm taking my laptop over as well just because i am behind on vlogs I'm a week behind, so I'm trying to catch up, but, you know, do you know when you just, like I said in the last vlog, I've just got, like, vlogger's blog, so, yeah, I'm just a bit like, mm. <laughs> Me and Lydia are going on a walk, aren't we? You're going on a walk? Do you want to hold my hand so you can get out? There we go, good girl. Yeah, look. You going on a walk? Yes. Cheers. Hold my pandy. There we go. You're beautiful. Are you pretty? Yeah. Yeah. Just off to the post office. Just gonna have my DBS in. Then we got run over. Yeah, I'm just gonna go have my DBS in. I'm just taking my dog for a walk. It's been a while since I took him out because every time I have He's got on poorly, but you know, can't keep him locked up, so taking him out again. And if he gets ill again after this, then we know that there's something around this area that makes him poorly. But we'll see how he is. I'm just I'm filming, but it's like really dark, so yeah. You alright, baby? Yeah? Hi peasants, today is Thursday and I'm just ready to go to work. I've not slept one little bit whatsoever. Like, I've been awake all night. There's been construction on a pub near where I live recently. And we've now got a mouse in the house. We're hoping it's just one mouse. 
Um, I think with the construction that's been going on and the cold weather, it's kind of disturbed them. And one of them, hopefully one of them, is in my house. Um, so my mum saw it first in her bedroom. So I went to try get it and I was screaming because it's a mouse. Like, if it's in a cage, and I'd be like, that's fine, but I don't want it running around my stuff. And then um, my mum was scared, so she came in to lay with me. Um, and then my dog, like, my bed's not that big. And then I had my mum and my dog and me, and it just wasn't happening. Um, so my mum got up to go downstairs to sleep on the couch, and then it ran across the living room floor. So I'm th I think it must have come down the wall cavity. So then she panicked again and came back up, and she was like, maybe it's out of my room now, so I'll stay in my room. And then I heard this noise, and then I looked, and this is mouse on my floor. So I was like, shit so i couldn't stay i get proper shaky and like oh my god it's awful so i said um in my mum's room we had a cup of tea this is like three o'clock in the morning and we just you know chatted about stuff and that and then we eventually nodded off i nodded off at the end of her bed um and throughout the night we left the tv on because we was hoping that the noise would scare off um the mouse um so we left the TV on and every time I heard a noise, I I'd literally fell asleep with the remote in my hand. I'd be like muting it and listening and then unmuting it and then it were awful. And then I managed to get like maybe an hour or two this morning. Um, I just sprawled out on my mum's bed. She'd got up at this point um, and I was just hoping for the best. I think I was too tired to like even realise that there might have been one in the room. So I've done that and now I'm just ready to go to work. Um... I've been round the bedroom spraying like spearmint oil um, with wash detergent and a cup of like a bit of oil because it scares off animals. So I'm gonna mix up cayenne pepper and then if not, it's live live traps because we have a dog, so it's really hard to get rid of like stuff like that. But if not, it's gonna have to be traps and just hope for the best um, because I don't want. Anything running around my room. The thing is, like, I have nothing in my room to attract anything. Like, I don't have any food in here. The only drinks I have is water. The odd cup of tea, but I don't have sugar in it. Um, the only thing I can think of is, like, when I've pulled this cupboard out of the corner of my bedroom, I've disturbed something. Or maybe it literally has just come from the pub. I don't know. Anyway, I've been ranting on for three minutes and 14 seconds about my nightmare night's sleep. So I'm going to work and yeah. Right guys, so I'm home now. I've been home for a while, a couple of hours. Um, I'm shitting myself because we still have the mouse in the house. We've sprayed everything, like repellent spray and stuff. It made its way into next door's house. Um, Nicola and the kids have been running and jumping and squealing. And then we'd not seen it in our house for a bit. And I was literally just sat here with the dog. And he it just went ape shit at the other side of the room. And was sniffing stuff like he saw stuff. So I'm literally just like, I've put the big light on. Because I aren't dying today. Like, I know a mouse is probably more scared than I am of it. That is of, what, what, what's the saying? It's probably more scared of me than I am of it. But I don't want a mouse in my house. So I'm sat with big light on. Just, just in case. But I'm absolutely, ow. I'm absolutely terrified. Like, oh my God. How am I supposed to sleep? Like, I've already, um... I'm staying in my mum's bed. She's already put TV on for me up there, so it's loud. So the vibrations of the TV might scare it off because the mouse might think there's someone up there or whatnot. Um, so that's on already. I'm sat. I'm I'm sat with big light on. I'm not a big light kind of person. I like to just sit in dark. You little shit. think I've just seen it. Fucking torture me on home. My dog's like, what the frig is she doing? I know, baby. I know. Come on. Absolutely terrified. No, I can, no, I can do. Like, just don't put best. 
neighbours next door tried catching it, but it was just too fast. But then everyone's like, oh, where? There's one, there's more. Like, don't say that. Just shut up. I don't need to know that. Currently having it off. Competition off with a mouse in my house. And I'm trying to get it. And it just, yeah, that's it. Disappear. You're coming out of here. I don't move, but it keeps trying to peek out. Got a feather dusty, little shit. I love you. Oh my god, I'm so scared. I want my mum. <laughs> Hi guys, today is Friday. I've just been running around this morning doing stuff like I've been tidying up, I've been to BM, I've been to Pound Stretcher, just stuff like that. As I said before, we have got a nice little friend in our home, not really a friend, it's a mouse who last night decided to run over my head whilst I was in bed. So I have not slept properly in 48 hours and I'm not happy I'm not an happy chappy and I'm really busy this weekend at work as well. But now it's just another Friday, I'm gonna go pick up my cousin from school. We have just got this really like old book, like this book is older than my bloody mother. It was my it was my grandma's and we're gonna give it to my auntie. It's like it's um the happy home book and it shows you how to have a happy home and there's like menus and recipes and stuff like that in there. Most of it's all to do with like water boilers and how um, hot water taps were the new thing so that's how old it is but um, yeah going to pick up my cousin from school and I think I'm going to get in later but I'll update you in a bit. Hi guys just sharpening my skirt. It's not nice in here at all it's absolutely awful. Like watch. <laughs> Awful in here. So I've just captured the mouse. Um, and I can hear it squealing. I've got my um, mouse trap here. Um, I can hear it squealing. Um, it was still alive, but it was trapped. I'm so shaky. Oh, going in. Going in. In, 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 in. So it was still alive. Mum, I can't do it, door. But I couldn't kill it, so I've let it go. Um, I let it off. I mean, it, it must have lost a leg, but I've let it off in um, grass over the road. But I think it's going to come back. Some, I can't, can't do with that. Some it ran under my feet when I went to go at bin. So help. <laughs> Good morning vlog. Today is Saturday. I'm just on my way to work. The weather is absolutely crazy this morning. Like insane. It's kept me up all night. It's been where my house is, it's been bashing against the walls, it's been raining, it's like, oh my god, it's been mental. So, um, I haven't slept much, but you know, I need to go to work now, so I'm going to do that. I'm in work till, well, little, 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 I can't even speak, I'm in work till like 4.30, maybe 5 o'clock, I don't know yet. Hi guys, so I've been at work, I've come home, got a shower freshened up and got changed. I'm now going back to work, but I'm not working, I'm just going to ice skate. Just go do some exercise and you know socialize my friend's dad's coming to pick me up um he always picks me up so blessed for that thank you very grateful um and yeah adios amigos we'll see you next year next next year next year. tomorrow <laughs> so hi guys it's like midnight and we just caught another mouse i had to run down the street and get rid of it because it was in one of our like human mouse traps whereas i went out and bought like lethal ones um yeah tonight i just went ice skating i didn't feel much um but i'm attempting to sleep in my own bed so that's great i've got my dog with me so my mom's terrified in her bedroom by herself because i've stolen the dog um but i heard something under my bed so i moved the trap I, I've got all my lamps on and I'm going to attempt to sleep in my own bed. I've got my laptop on quite loud, thinking the noise might scare him off. But he is hoping that I don't die again. Home sweet home, not vlogged today, is Sunday in my bedroom. Home sweet home, bitches. And guess whose home it is? It's mine. So mice if you want to come at me 
I'm going to kill you today because I'm in that frame of mind. This is my house and not yours. So basically, if you don't know, not like I've been moaning about it all bloody week, my neighbours have mice, which means we have mice. And I've killed one. Well, one got its leg stuck in a trappy trap, a snappy trap. So I let it off. It's probably gone away to die. One of them got rescued. No, it didn't. I tell a lie. One of them landed in the nice trap that keeps them alive. And um, I let that go. And I slept in my bed for the first time last night in four days. So, yeah. But if we keep getting the mice, but my neighbours are willing to put their traps down, then it's just a never-ending battle, isn't it? So, I'm just about to check my trap down here. Because I did hear... Oh, cheeky sods. I knew it. Last night, I did hear something under my bed after I'd already got rid of one in my mum's room. And I'm right. They've they've eaten whatever is on the, the trap. And then took it off like a free fucking meal. Right, mice, I'm coming for you. So, come at me, twat. It's my house. Get out of here. I actually sound like I'm drugged up, don't I? Oh, shit. That was my fingers. <laughs> Joke. I'd know about it. So, yeah. Been at work all day today. Can't even shut my curtains. I'm scared of mouth in them. So, I just put my blind down. Been at work all day today. Nothing exciting. Um, Just messing around, to be honest. I've done all my job and everything, but then I was just, like, play fighting with my mates. So, yeah. It's a great time. And now I've come home and I've just got this, like, massive, like, bundle of energy that I'm... Don't know where it's come from, so that's all right. Um, so yeah, this week's not been that like exciting whatsoever. Um, I got a new sofa coming tomorrow, and my new sunglasses, and I got to pick Alex up from school, and there's somewhere else. So some, like next week might be even better than this week because I don't know. I don't do exciting things. Like I just have a normal life of a normal person, and I don't go out of my way to make better content on daily vlogs because. It's not what I do in my life. So, yeah, you either like it or you lump it. And I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for listening to my rant. See ya. Thanks for listening to my rant. <laughs> um, see us tomorrow. Enjoy this vlog. And adios. Adios, and me come home from work and your mum's pissed. <laughs> don't show me fat legs. I'm not. <laughs> you got your Playboy stuff on though, yeah? <laughs> she was just saying because look at my living room now because we're getting a new couch tomorrow so shut up there's like nothing in here so i'm crouched on the floor she's literally like sat on a chair <laughs> on a table she's sat on a table um but yeah <laughs> this is a wild sunday night isn't it <laughs> super 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 what is the other one oh my goodness <laughs>